one of the most important, I probably should have put this as number one, to be honest with you, this is my most valuable tip of all, is to put a title or a hook in your reel to get people to stop the scroll and see what you're talking about. So using the text overlay tool, you're able to add a title or a headline that will hook people in. So you got to think about this. There are so many people that are using reels now that say you click on an audio and you're going to go record a reel. You'll probably see like hundreds, if not thousands of other reels posted there. And more than likely, if that reel has like a title or a headline that really resonates with you, you're probably going to click that one more than like just a pretty picture of someone sitting there. Like you don't know what that's about. So it's so important to use a good title and your title needs to speak to your audience. Um, if you can, I, I tried to show you guys some examples of mine. I try to keep it, so, my titles usually are very like pain point grabbing, like seven things you didn't know about reels, um, new trend alert, uh, how I grew 70,000 followers, something that just like stops the scroll and makes them want to learn more. That's gonna be a really good, headline or title for you guys. And it's also super duper important to have clear um, writing on there. So the Reels editing function actually has a lot of different titles that you can use. Uh, font choices, I guess is what I mean. Fonts and colors, you can literally do bright pink or super bright yellow. But I'm telling you like that is hard on the eyes and you don't wanna make people squint to read. So you need to think about your branding, which my branding is that greenish blue and pink where you guys I think Tracy you said that you guys they can change their branding to whatever colors they want so pick something I would pick simple like black and white maybe um with like a pop color but just don't pick anything that's too bright um don't pick the font that's really thick or hard to read and you'll know exactly what I'm talking about when you do go to write a title or to play with the text tool you'll see all the different fonts and you'll know like, oh, I bet Caitlin was talking about this one because there's some that even look like scribble and it just, it turns people off and they won't watch your video.